Hello and welcome to the Cinema 4D Quick Tips. Let's say you've got a character and you want to create some face poses using sculpting. And I'm already in the sculpt layout here and got the grab brush selected. So I could immediately start and shape a pose here, but um, I cannot export that one. Now let me show you the workflow how to export this to a pose morph tag so you can use it later in animation. Let me undo these two steps and let me first hit subdivide one time and you can see that this will create a sculpt layer. And I want to create another sculpt layer and I want to call this pose one and then I start sculpting with this layer active. So let's just create a face expression like that. And then maybe a second face expression that also should be exported to the pose morph tag. So we need another sculpting layer here and call this pose two. Make the first one invisible. And now we start sculpting the second one. Let's make this a smile or something. And now I've got these two face expressions and I can use the strength slider here to blend between them. I can also bring up pose one again and blend here. But how can I export them to the pose morph tag, which is necessary in order to set keyframes for them? Well, the first thing is that all of the poses need to be visible here. So that might look a little bit weird, but then you have to click sculpt to pose morph down here. And once you did that, a second mesh is being created and let me go to the objects manager here and make the initial fish invisible. And then you can see that we've got a new fish geometry. Maybe let's also subdivide this like so. With a pose morph tag applied and you can see that we've got pose one and pose two in here. And if I go to animate now and bring them down to zero, we can just blend these poses in or out and set keyframes and therefore use them for animation. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy our quick tips, please like, comment and subscribe.